Hey, what's going on, Dr. Poole? My name is Jack here with Mr. and Mrs. Leeds. We are a local online marketing and SEO uh, agency here in Colorado Springs. And um, I actually uh, drove to your uh, location yesterday um, and talked to the, um, the uh, who was uh, stopped by at the front desk. And um, I kind of introduced myself and um, I picked up a business card. Um, and so I, I saw an email on here, so I figured I'd just go ahead and do this and, and just kind of shoot in the dark and see if you are interested in this kind of thing. And then um, if you are, then hopefully you like what I'm saying here in the video, and then we can just kind of talk further about what we can do. But um, what I want to do in this video analysis is basically go over exactly what I can see as a search marketer in terms of where your website is and kind of what we need to do in terms of online marketing to make sure that you show up front and center when people search up the kinds of things that have to do with like dentists in Colorado Springs and dental and that kind of thing. And so um, I'm sure, uh, you know, uh, nowadays you understand, Dr. Poole, just how important it is to be uh, a presence and build a brand online. Um, it's I would say that it's even more powerful than um, um, building a brand locally just because of the sheer number of people that, are, that have smartphones that use it constantly and um, as well as laptops and computers, right? And so what I mean by that is, um, Nowadays, when you're uh, looking for a specific service, right? So if your toilet's broken or you need plumbing repair, um, you're, you know, you're probably odds are you're probably going to go straight to your smartphone and search up plumbing repair near me or plumbing Colorado Springs, or maybe you know you need uh, your tree cut, yeah, right? you know, tree removal service Colorado Springs, that kind of thing. And so that's essentially what people are doing, even in the dentist field, just really any local business nowadays. And I can show you that here in a sec, but basically we just want to make sure because so many people are behind their phones, laptops, computers, and things like that, just searching up things like, hey, um, uh, best dental care, uh, Colorado Springs, or dentist near me, or dental care, Colorado Springs, dentist in Colorado Springs, all kinds of different phrases. And we just want to make sure that you're front and center so that you get a lot of business um, coming your way um, from online. And that's where we specialize in, right? As we do SEO and search engine optimization, that kind of thing. So without further ado, let me go ahead and adopt, uh, dive into the actual nitty gritty of what I can see, all right? So the first thing I did was I pulled up your website here in a tool called AREFs. Uh, AREFs allows search marketers like myself to uh, look at the metrics of a site and see kind of what I can see as a search marketer and where we need to be at, all right? So what I can see right off the bat is that it is a relatively new site. Um, I did a little bit of homework before I recorded this video. I believe that it was created like back in February, so just a couple of months back. And so we're not seeing a lot of metrics and things like that. And so basically what this means is because Google can't uh, recognize, hasn't actually crawled through the site or given you credit or anything like that, you're basically um, not showing up in Google search engine. So whether you type in, um, uh, and now, by the way, when you're doing it yourself, you want to make sure you do it in incognito mode or else it's going to actually save uh, your history. And so what we need to do is actually just go into uh, incognito mode and then just type in like, um, Elm Family Dentistry. Let's see if we can actually pull up some. Oh, no, yeah. So it does pull up right here, Elm Family Dental. So that's good. Actually, I guess it's just AREFs hasn't been able uh, had a chance to crawl it. So at the very least, we're getting um, uh, found for Elm Family Dentistry. Now, I guarantee it's going to be a different case when we actually search up specific keywords related to like dentists in Colorado Springs, that kind of thing. And that's kind of what we need to do because, um, you know, it's very important, obviously, because we run into situations where like our client doesn't rank for their brand name. Um, because it's kind of tends to be like a more common phrase or something like that. But um, the fact that you are on the first page is good news um, because that's when people are searching your brand. But then there's a lot of people that just don't know about a brand in the local area. They don't know about like, you know, dental care or, you know, Elm family dentistry. And so what they do is they just type in dentist near me or best dentist Colorado Springs, that kind of thing, right? So um, what I want to do is I want to hop over to our Keywords Explorer tool and go ahead and show you kind of what's kind of keywords are actually possible um, out there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to type in Dentist Colorado Springs. All right, and see what we can pull up. So you'll see right here, Dentist Colorado Springs, that phrase in itself gets 1,500 searches a month. And now this actually tends to be on the lower end of what it actually is, but it's a ridiculous amount of searches. Um, we work with a lot of local businesses, right? And um, most of the time, their main keyword gets searched about 200, 300 uh, um, like keyword volume. And when we get them on the first page, they get tons of business, right? So 
Um, the fact that this is 1,500 searches per month means that there is a ton of people that are looking for dentists in Colorado Springs and literally going behind the computer and typing in dentist Colorado Springs. Same with Colorado Springs dentist. Um, you can see how literally, you know, the, the, so this is basically the keyword plus location, right? And this is location plus keyword. Just in the fact that those two are, are in the different order is actually tracked by Google because everyone has different vocabulary, right? And so not everyone's typing in dentist Colorado Springs. Some people are typing in Colorado Springs dentist and all these other ones. And so we want to make sure that we optimize it for these kinds of keywords. So here at Mr. And Mrs. Leeds, what we do is we optimize our such search engine optimization strategy around the specific keyword set that we want to go after. All right. So what I mean by that is basically uh, we don't want to go after keywords that people aren't actually searching into Google. So you might think that like emergency dental care in Colorado Springs gets tons of searches, gets 600,000 searches per month, but turns out it only gets 10 searches per month. We don't want to optimize our campaign for that keyword unless it's something you really want to go after because of the fact that um, uh, there's just not a lot of searches per month and we can use that advertising budget and our SEO campaign and our uh, strategy on more optimal keywords where people are actually searching for more uh, more people are searching for a different phrase for example dentist Colorado Springs CEO actually gets 250 searches per month cosmetic dentist gets 250 best dentist in Colorado Springs gets 200 that's actually a really good one you want to rank for uh, emergency dentist uh, Colorado Springs that phrase actually gets 200 searches per month right and so that's kind of how we work here we just want to make sure we work backwards grab the most optimal keyword set that you vibe with and you uh, uh, want to rank for as well as makes sense for us in our SEO campaign and then go after those all right so hopefully that makes sense to you if you have any questions um, you're you know, obviously more than welcome to um, um, call me or email me in the email that I send out to you. Um, that way I can answer and address any questions, comments, concerns you have. All right. Um, I think the site looks great. Um, what I would personally like to see is maybe an image of the building because you, actually you're in a pretty, pretty dope location. Uh, you're at, like on Wall Street and it's like it's a building by itself. So I think that could be a really cool um, image that you do uh, or picture that you do on the home page. And so all this, all the service pages and everything um, looks great. Um, whoever built your site did a good job. And there's some content on here. Um, what we need to do is we need to make sure that the hit request appointment. So we okay. So it takes us to the contact form. So yeah, um, email, subject, message. That's all good. Um, I would actually have a contact form like immediately down here. That's very simple. It's like email, number, comment. And, and see if you can actually capture a little bit more because a lot of people are gonna actually be hitting your homepage and you'll lose a certain percentage of people by um, having them actually click the contact us, right? So um, here at Mr. and Mrs. Leeds, we understand as a business, it's not just about us bringing you traffic to your site. It's not just about us getting you on the first page. It's about how many people are actually calling you and setting appointments and actually going through the process, right? Because at the end of the day, it's about the dark, uh, dollar market dollars that you're spending into marketing and what you're getting back from that. And so we understand that. So um, what I'm really talking about at this point is conversion, right? So now that they're visiting your site, now that you're being found on the internet for these various keywords, um, now it's a matter of uh, making sure that you show up, or um, I'm sorry, for that they actually sign up for your services and then they, they actually show up, right? So um, one last thing is like the map portion. What I want to do actually, do you see right here, uh, it says map. You know what I would say? I would actually change it to directions, right? And so what happens is they click directions and this right here, you can see how this is a drag. You can actually turn this into a link, right? And the link is actually a button that takes them straight to the directions and all they have to do is just hit um, start now, right? So it'll actually pull up the address, it'll pull up their current location. If it doesn't, then it's gonna ask them to turn on their location, enable GPS, and they'll hit yes. And then after that, all they have to hit is, uh, um, uh, start navigation or whatever that button is and so when they, once they click that it'll automatically go same with right, right here um, what I want to do is like I just want to actually make it a clickable button so that that way even this is even if this is pertinent to them right they still have that option to just be able to click here or, or maybe say like click here uh, uh, to be uh, guided to your uh, guided to um, um, Elm family dentistry right or maybe like on mobile or on desktop or something like that Right, so something like that would be great. Uh, I think the about, and then you have your you you Dr. Pool right here. There we go. Great photo, great bio. Yeah, that's all good. 
That's all good. And you, yeah, you even have your staff. So you've got all the all the all the missing pieces on here. So um, especially in a dentist where you it's a lot of face to face interaction. So and they're working with teeth. That's something that people would like to see, like a face behind a business. So the fact that you have that is great. So um, I'll wrap it up here, Dr. Poole. Um, hope at the very least you got some insight out of this, but would love to talk to you about what we can do uh, in terms of your online marketing and SEO. Now, I only talked about search engine optimization and ranking you organically, but there is a lot of stuff we can do um, um, online uh, with like paid advertising on Facebook ads, um, Google AdWords and Bing AdWords, and all the various other channels that we um, utilize. Uh, it's just I didn't want this video to be like 15, 20 minutes, and I do value your time. And uh, if, if that's something you are interested in, obviously that's a different service that we actually provide as well. Uh, it's just a matter of uh, starting the communication, and then we can just kind of get the ball rolling from there. All right, Dr. Poole, appreciate it, and hope you have a great day. Thank you.